Hey, welcome back to another episode of Quick Tips. I'm probably awake. And today we are going to talk about building a melody or building some type of song arrangement over a pre-existing sample. So here's a sample I picked out for today's demonstration. And here's what it sounds like untampered. I'm just gonna go ahead and drag this to a new audio track. I'm gonna put it back to the pitch that it was at and then I'll play it without any effects on it. So here's what we got. So basically just this kind of ARP, or not even ARP, but a little synth line that just is playing down keys, or here are the keys exactly that it's playing um, when it's pitched up. And then here's what it sounds like with some effects on it. So instead of it just going down, I went ahead and edited this to go back up instead of it going down and then I added a little bit of a couple filler notes in between. And basically, you can take this sound, right? So I pitched it up, I added a couple more notes and then I start building around it. So I'm gonna go ahead and start soloing a couple things that you can do in your own production that could potentially get you um, a pretty good sounding intro or whatever you're trying to make by just building around a sample. So the first thing I added was this atmosphere and I'll go ahead and just solo it by itself and then I'll play each element with the um, original sample that we used. So the atmosphere, I think that's always easy to add, get the tone of the song, see if it's actually in the key that it's saying it's in. And then I added this little arp. So there's a lot of the frequency already taken up. It doesn't sound too thin yet. It's lacking a bass, but we'll get to that shortly. And then I added this re-space over top of it, but I have the low end EQ'd out. So for this synth group, I have all of the under 200 Hertz frequencies taken out. And then the compressor, I just have it go into the kick for sidechain. So we'll add this re-space. And then we have some notes playing along with the main melody. And those are two patches. Here's one. And here's two. And then in conjunction, it sounds like this. And then if we introduce the bass, which is all the way down here, this is the bass I'm using. And if we play it from the intro, here's what it sounds like all together. So, in just a couple minutes, you can find a synth line or something that you like, or even just write one, of course. But for me, I can find pretty good inspiration if I just find something I like, tune it to the key I like, and then start building around it. And this probably all together probably took no more than, say, half an hour to kind of fine tune it, to key everything in, to add a little bit of vocal chops and whatnot. But pretty easy start to a song, I would recommend doing this if you're having a little bit of writer's block. So next time you might get into a rut or can't think of a song idea, try this out and let me know how it goes. With all this being said, thank you for watching and we'll see you again on the next video.